morning happy saturday well, obviously stuffy this morning this is a super flattering angle for me but so let's focus on the baby he's looking out the blinds right now at the blinds right now but it is like we got up at 7 30 i think he nursed for a little bit and then i decided we didn't have to go back to sleep so we're just chilling. We're snuggling. We snuggling. Can I take a morning? He loves laying like this with his arms over his head. That's so cute. Say good morning. Good morning, Bob. New drinking game. Every time I talk to the baby with my mommy baby voice, drink. In this video because I'm sure it's gonna be a lot you want to get our day started you want to tell them how, how we do on the weekend so I wanted to show you guys our little like setup we have in the bedroom right now for him because he is still sleeping in our bedroom um, for now but um so um, since he has a reflex he actually sleeps in his rock and play at night um, he doesn't sleep with us, by the way. He sleeps in his rock and play. Um, we did start out in the dock -a tot and the bed, and then we transferred the dock -a tot to the bassinet. And then um, we found out with his reflex, it would be better for him to sleep in the rock and play. So we tr I've tried since then, because it's gotten a lot better. Um, but uh, putting him in his dock, -a dock -a tot instead of the rock and play, and he's still kind of, um, he has silent reflex that, like, comes up and then it kind of sounds like he's choking um if he lays flat too soon so it scared me so I put him back in the rock and play um but we might try again because he's doing a lot better sleeping flat when he does sleep in the bed with us so um so yeah so anyway so we have the tot still um and I'd like to try to use it again because he really loved it this is a baby monitor that I use in case I go in the bedroom or in the living room like at night when I put him down or um, if I'm doing my makeup in the other room, I can turn it on and then just a really warm blanket just in case. Sometimes when I'm nursing him, I like put it on both of us. Um, a pillow for nursing, just a regular pl plain pillow, nothing fancy. I want to show you guys this light. This is from Amazon. Um, it has a really big clip and then has different settings. Uh, a warm light and then a white light and then, oh, and then... I can't remember what that's for. I guess brightness. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, but we do just the regular, and then I usually do the warm light at nighttime. Um, but that way I can see, and it doesn't blind us in the bed, like my husband and I. But I can see him, and it's still dark enough, so I really would suggest one of those or something like that. And then we moved the ottoman from his nursery into here. Because I couldn't, especially when I first got home, my back was hurting so bad from the epidural. I couldn't, um, I couldn't sit in the bed and nurse. Um, I'm better at it now, but, um, I still usually get up and just nurse him in the, on the, in the rocker. And then the nightstand has all the essentials. <laughs> uh, the pump right now, which is hooked up with one, because, um, on the weekends at night, I nurse him on one side, then pump on the other. Or I try to, anyways. Um, and... Uh, clippers, I clipped his fingernails yesterday when I was nursing him yesterday morning when I was nursing him. I would say that is the biggest help, um, or tip if you can nurse and, uh, clip his fingernails at the same time. Um, it, like, helps a lot. And then obviously a big water thing filled with water, usually an ice. I, like, that cup has gone with me everywhere since I've been pregnant. Um, even when I was pregnant, I was super thirsty, but then breastfeeding is, like, on a whole other level. Um, and that's Chapstick Aquaphor. Y'all, if you don't use Aquaphor, um, Chapstick, you are missing out. It is so good. Um, and then a protein bar. This is a fiber one. Protein bar. I used these when I was pregnant, um, because of, you know, they're chocolate, but they're, um, like, the carbs and everything were good for you when I had gestational diabetes, and they taste really good, so... And then a hair tie, just FYI too. And then okay, so I just ran a straightener through my hair really quick and throw on some clothes and brush my teeth. The only reason I did that is because um, I have a friend coming over today in a little bit this morning um, to do makeup. Um, she's 
starting a new job and she wants to learn how to do um, like good every day, um, you know, quick makeup. So she's gonna come over, we're gonna play with makeup and he was just chilling for me on the bed. And now we're gonna go cook breakfast, get the house cleaned up and get ready for my friend to come over. Where are Bob's? But on a normal day, um, I would still be in my PJs. I would not have done my hair. And I'm not entirely sure if I'm gonna do makeup either today or not, but obviously I'm kind of like feeling under the weather a little bit, <clears throat> as y'all can tell probably from my voice. What you got say? Wheel. Wheel. Is that your wheel face? So you want to get the day started? Let's do this. You guys are probably about to judge, but whatevs, don't care. Um, I sit him in his little bouncer chair, which he freaking loves. He's just chilling. You just chilling, Bobs? And then, um... He watches cartoons for a little bit while I'm making coffee and getting breakfast going. Um, I have dishes in the sink, so yeah, real life. Hashtag real life. Um, so yeah, so and I'm just making Folgers. Nothing fancy around this joint. So let's make some breakfast. Nothing just like starting your morning with a cup of coffee. Man. Mm. So good. Okay, so one of my favorite breakfasts to make is a sweet potato like hash, I guess. Um, so I just steam fry these potatoes, um, sweet potatoes, but I spray a little bit of olive oil on them and salt and pepper and then we put them in the pan and let them steam and then like brown a little bit so i was doing my makeup on instagram stories and i burned my hash i mean my sweet potatoes so i guess we're just gonna make a protein shake instead for breakfast dang it All right, somebody's hungry, so we're going to change him, change his diaper, get him in some clothes for today, and then we're going to eat. Oh, no, Baba, you ready to eat? Okay, I'm always ready to eat, Mom. Can you say gigam? The gigam Maggie's. So we gotta represent today, huh? Okay, so he is nursing now. Um, I did go ahead and put some makeup on. Um, I did that on my Instagram stories this morning. So if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, um, if do if you want to, <laughs> I do a lot of stories like makeup stories and stuff like that, um, and reviews and like randomness on there. Uh, <clears throat> so it's 9 30 did I ever say that I think I said that already um so we hung out for like an hour and a half maybe two hours I think two hours actually um from when we woke up to now um so we got the house straightened up got obviously got him changed you guys saw that you saw me burn my breakfast so I don't know what I'm gonna eat now um and if you have breastfed before or breastfeeding you know like the hunger is real so I'm starving right now I cannot believe I did that I was trying to hurry. That was my problem. Um, and yeah, so my friend will be here in a little bit. So we're going to do her makeup and hang out with her for a little bit. Um, I don't know if I'll vlog during that. Um, we'll see. But I mean, you know, it's kind of weird. I feel like I'm not ready for that yet. I'm not really about that vlog life. And like, 
you know, asking other people to be on my channel, that's kind of, like, I don't know, awkward, but. Really quick, uh, while I'm nursing him this weekend, I decided to read this book. Um, one of my, um, one of the moms on one of my, one of the moms on one of my mom groups from, um, Facebook suggested reading this. Um, it's Love Unending, Rediscovering Your Marriage in the Midst of Motherhood. Um, and she said it just really, like, spoke to her and was very helpful. So, I thought, I picked up from Amazon, it was like $8 prime and everything. So, I'm gonna read this while I'm nursing him this weekend. So, I'll keep you guys updated on uh, what I think, if I think it's worth picking up or not. So mama tried for 30, 45 minutes to get somebody to take a nap because he's very sleepy. And I was unsuccessful, wasn't I? Somebody's just not taking naps. You got anything you want to say about that? Cranky butt. So my friend left about 12 something. It's now 1.40. Um, I tried to get him to go down for a nap. I like, um, um, what did we do? We nursed for off and on for a while. Try to put him down, try to cuddle him, all sorts of stuff. And he still won't go down for a nap, so... We're still just going to try some other things, some different techniques. I'm just going to have to honestly trial and error it, I feel like, right now. Um, when I was on maternity leave, he used to always take a really good nap from 12 to about 2.30, almost 3 o'clock. And then last month, he just decided, nope, no naps. Literally, he maybe takes two 20-minute naps during the day. This week, when I took him back to my grandmother's um, while I went back to work, he took um, a few good naps, she said, so that was really good, but i am still got to get him on a better sleep schedule during the day. Um, he's on a good sleep schedule at night most of, most of the time. Um, he had one bad uh, night this week, so, um, but for the most part, he's still really good at nighttime, but during the day, he's got to get more sleep. Got to get more sleep. Um, so we're working on that today. Um, like I said, my friend left, so I, I didn't obviously vlog through that because we were just doing her makeup and then visiting and just hanging out a little bit. So, did her makeup and, um, she left and now we're going to get back to our normal day. So I was in the back bedroom, uh, our bedroom, because it's dark. I have to black out curtains back there and then his normal little sleep area. So I kind of set that up and was trying to get him to go back to sleep. But, so now I'm going to eat some lunch because I'm starving. I still haven't ate and it's one almost two o'clock so we are doing some we're trying the potatoes again so we are trying i steamed them up earlier now i'm warming them up and kind of like getting them a little bit more brown my dad would be killing me if he saw me using a fork on this plate right i mean on this thing right now but that's all i had right there so trying to hurry and then i'm going to make some turkey wraps so let's get that stuff out Okay, so whole wheat tortilla, and I take it on the stove and like warm it up and crisp it up. Then I slice, I like a half a slice of cheese on both, so a whole slice of cheese for both some mustard and this is actually ham. I thought we had turkey, but ham. Just roll it up. I'm having two today since I haven't had breakfast. Some sweet potatoes, some ketchup on the side, and I could not be more hungry right now. And a handful of M and M's. <clears throat> it's called balance, people. Balance. Maybe be in Betsy.
asleep. It's like 2.30. He was asleep on me a little bit before, so I'm hoping he'll take like an hour nap at least. That's a better start than like what he has been doing, so praying that worked. Now I'm like scared to talk. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna, I need to do some dishes. And I'm gonna watch some mommy shows. So bravo, here we come. Are you awake? Oh my goodness. That's very long. Good morning. Guess it's better than nothing. Oh, you're okay. Come on, let's get you up. Okay, so it's 3.05. So maybe 45 minute nap. He slept on me for a while before I actually put him down, and then it was like 2.30 when I got back in here, I think. Right? 2.30? <sighs> Better than nothing, so let's change his diaper real quick. Good morning! Hi! Good morning! Okay, so I'm nursing him now, and I'm actually going to pump on the other side while I'm nursing him. I'm trying to get my supply up a little bit. And, um, what else? Really, that's all we do is he nurses. I try to take him down for a nap. He won't nap. We play a little bit, then it's like a revolving door, so... Are you full? Mm? Or not yet. He just woke up from a little nap. He napped on me for a little bit. Um, and he now he's going to play. And there's a little play mat. We got this from Target. This is an Infantino brand little teepee that like grows with them as they're um, as they go. Like grows with them as they go. So we're gonna play. We're gonna do a little bit of tummy time. See, you can see that we haven't done that today. Um, day kind of just flew by. Say hi. Good job. Good job, Bubs. Can you show him how you roll over? Huh? Can you show him? See yourself. <laughs> Say hi, everybody. Say hi, everybody. <laughs> so we just gave him a bottle because he was acting like he was really hungry. So I combined a couple of the pumps that I, or like bags that I've pumped over the week, or over, <laughs> over the weekend so far, and he ate that, 
scarfed it down. Now we're just sitting here. I'm ready for dinner. Dude, this is a glamorous life, isn't it, Bob's? He loves the TV. You know, the shapes and the colors and everything. He's just like, I mean, obviously you see him wide-eyed. Like, wow. Wow. Okay, so I'm about to mix up his um, Nexium medicine for his reflux because it is almost 8 o'clock and we give it to him at 8 o'clock. And then he has to wait 30 minutes before we can eat so then I give him a bath and then normally get him down for bed um, a little bit after that. So here is his medicine. Okay, so we are trying um, Young Living Essential Oils. One of my friends is letting me borrow her diffuser for the week so we can try out different things. And we've been doing the Gentle Baby at night, which this is just night two of trying it. So I'm going to get the diffuser ready, get our room ready for bedtime, and then get him into the bath. It's kind of our nighttime routine, I guess. Okay, so Rock and Play is ready. Essential oils are going. Got my pump over there. And I normally um, have my water already ready too, but I haven't had dinner yet, so I'm going to be up a little later tonight than usual. I go ahead and turn the light, night light on, so that way it's ready, and then I turn the main light off. And then, so that way the broom is dark, and it's ready to go, and um, he doesn't have to, like, come into a bright room or um, kind of get the nighttime, like, in his head, I guess. I don't know if it works, but that's what we do. So then I'm gonna go ahead, I get closer, a little closer to about 8.30. I usually about 8.20, we get him in the bath, get him in bath, get him dressed, get him changed, and I bring him in here and nurse, and then we put him down for bed. So here we go. Okay, so I get the water, obviously, to the good temperature, which is like really hard. It's like either too hot or too cool. I try to get it just a nice warm temperature. And then I go ahead and fill his little um, Fisher Price thing up. On the tub. This tub is from Fisher Price. I would not suggest it. I really don't like it very much at all. But like I thought I would really love it because it's like different stages. It had like a newborn like net thing, which I like that. But this stage right now, he's that he's in. I don't like it very much at all. Um, so yeah, but oh well, better than nothing. And then I have two washcloths and then some. Johnson and Johnson baby wash. Yeah. Okay, so we're taking our bath, huh? He loves bath time. Loves, loves, loves hanging out in the bathtub. He's so cute. He just relaxes. Just hangs out. So we're gonna take our bath and get ready for bed, huh? Are you splashing? Show me you splash. Oh my goodness, that was a big splash. It's splashing, 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 splashing. Splashing, splashing. You love it, huh? You love it. Be careful. Hi, little fox. Hi, little fox. Now we're going to get dried off. Right. Get our diaper on and then get our jammies on. You ready? Ready?
good night, guys. Can you tell him good night? Thanks for hanging out with us today. And what else you guys say? So we hope you weren't too drunk if you played the drinking game every time I made a baby voice. <laughs> but I can't help it. He's so cute. Say good night. Don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see y'all in the next video. Bye. Okay, I was editing the, vid the footage earlier today. And I realized I did not tell you guys about the giveaway that I'm doing. Um, that I mentioned in my previous video. So if you guys didn't see my previous video, I will link it up here or up here or... I don't know what side, but somewhere up here. Um, it has all the details about how you can win a big box of um, beauty goodies, literally just random goodies for makeup, skincare, fragrance, all that sort of jazz. Um, it's very easy to enter. You have a week left, so go to that video, um, watch it, and find out how you can be entered to win. And that's all. Sorry. I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you all in my next one. Bye. Again, for the second time.